Well, I wonder what you belong to in your life. This is the famous, well, I say famous, famous if you're from York. Welcome to Bootham Crescent sign. And my friend won it in a blind auction when they shut the ground down. Point is, thousands of fans have walked under this sign for many, many years in this city, feeling like they passionately belong to something, belong to York City, belong to a community of supporters uh, who share in cities' ups and mainly downs. But it's an interesting thing when you belong to something because it can be incredibly enriching and life-giving. My friend the other day, he was talking about his pub, his local pub, almost like I would talk about church. I said, he said it was a place that, that brings in friendship and community and somewhere where he can air his opinions and, and things like that. In a spiritual sense, belonging is absolutely essential. From a Christian perspective, we belong in two ways. We belong to a group of fellow believers and, and spiritual travellers and, and we support each other and help each other and, and, and discuss things with each other and pray together and eat together. There's an enormous sense of belonging together. And I find that um, really enriching and really helpful in my life. But I also belong um, to God himself. I am what the Bible calls a child of God. And, and I belong in the sense that he knows me and loves me and forgives me and, and journeys with me on my life. And um, so those two strands of belonging to people and to God are an essential part, whatever faith it is, um, of, of spiritual development and, and flourishing. Um, but whether it's a football team, whether it's a pub, whether it's in a, from a faith perspective, I wonder what you belong to. I wonder if you've ever thought about that. I wonder if you've ever thought that actually I don't belong to anything and, and whether that's something for you to think about and, and to perhaps do something about. Belonging, really important.